Sorry folks, if you were expecting a quick review on Evil Dead Rise, I unfortunately couldn't. Isn't that right, Paul? Ah, uh, relax. It's not like you were gonna like it. Anyway, what movie did you make me watch instead? Suzume! The film tells the story of a young girl named Suzume, who stumbles across a mysterious man called Soda. Later in the film, Suzume finds a door in an abandoned place and accidentally unleashes a monstrous entity. It's up to Suzume and Soda to go on a wild adventure and save the world. I honestly thought the film was decent. One of the movie's strong points are its gorgeous visuals. There are some sort that are honestly pretty. To be frankly honest, I totally agree. It's pretty much like if you took a Studio Ghibli movie and cracked it up you know, to a thousand. The chair thing though. Yikes, so um, okay, so in the movie, when we first meet the stone as kitten, it places a curse on Soda, turning him into a chair, and honestly, I thought that was stupid. I mean, it could potentially be funny, but it never manages to be, and even though I got used to it, it honestly sticks out as much as whenever the movie tries to blend 2D and 3D. That's just to say they do not blend well at all. Going back to the positives, the animation in the film is obviously well done. Whenever characters such as Suzumi run, it's done very neatly and very accurately. Whenever someone cries, the weight and fluidity of the animation makes it m that much more believable. If there's one thing I wish they gave more attention to, it's making the threat actually threatening and intense. The monstrous entity is seen by Suzume and Soda. It doesn't really sound that bad until you realize only they can see it, everyone else can't and thus reacts accordingly. It really underplays the threat and I honestly think it would have been better if everyone could see it, making the situation way more tense. But hey, at least the movie gave us the best characters ever. And let me guess, it's the cats. cats. Yes. I love how insane and messed up the kitten is at first, but the little dude eventually warms up and won me over. As for the black cat, it doesn't do much, but it's still just as adorable. You know, wouldn't it be the best if we were all cats? But then who would feed us? Hmm... I guess you're right. <coughs> but as a whole, even though I thought the movie was decent and the pacing could have been a touch faster, I still relatively enjoyed it. I just wouldn't wholeheartedly recommend it. And coming from someone who adored it, I wholeheartedly recommended it. It basically just comes down to preference and whether you're up for it or not. Well, that was fun. I know, right? We should do this more often. In fact, what are your quick reviewing next? Evil Dead Rise. And he left. Dang it.